Like, <laughs> anytime I do something smart, like unexpected smart, I pull the line from The Rock when he's like, I don't need a map, it's all inside my head. <laughs> That's the only one that I can really do. <laughs> So anyways, I learned this song, right? And I'm like, all right, this is gonna freaking nice. pop off, dude. This is gonna be a, this is gonna be hilarious. It's gonna be a good time. Everybody's gonna have a good time. La, 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 whatever. So I learned this song and never really get the opportunity to use it. And uh, one night I go to the, uh, to a local bar and they have a uh, open mic night. <laughs> And uh, I was like, okay, sweet. I'm going to play some music. And, and like, they had instruments for you to play. So I was like, okay, cool. I'll just I'll play some music. It, that'll be fun. I haven't played in a long time in front of anybody. It'll be a good time. And so I'm hanging out, playing some music, right? And there's this huge table in front of the stage, this really long table. And it's full of people. And I was like, obviously they're here celebrating. They're doing something, having a good time. And so I took that opportunity to like get on mic and be like, hey, how's it going everybody? Been uh, having fun playing for all you guys. Just wondering, is there anybody out here that is having a birthday? <laughs> Cause I was like baiting him in to play that song. I was like, I'm gonna get somebody and they're gonna freaking listen to this song. Oh sweet. Sweet. And, uh, <laughs> so somebody at that really long table raises their hand up and they're like, oh, this girl, she just had a birthday or she's about to have her birthday or something. It was like some close time. It wasn't even like her birthday, but I was like, whatever. I'm taking this opportunity. We are going to play this song and it's going to be hilarious. Everyone at the bar is going to have a good old gap. Have some laughs. It's going to be a good time. So I start playing it. And I'm having a good time playing. And um, I start noticing, like, everybody's just kind of, like, giving me a really bad look. And uh, I, like, start getting into the naughty bits of that song. And, dude, I... <laughs> In the middle of the song, this guy that was sitting in the very, very front of that table, right next to the stage, dude, he leans over, he taps me on my knee while I'm playing the song and singing about her mom and dad banging each other, railing each other hard, and going into all the gritty bits about it. It's a very erotic song again. And dude, talking about her dad's rock hard wiener and her mom and her panties and all of these stuff like really <laughs> bad stuff this guy taps me on my knee and leans forward and he's like um her dad just died <laughs> they were there in memorum of her father who just passed away who I was just mentioning who about his rock hard wiener <laughs> dude <laughs> I was like I don't know what to do because I was in the middle of the song right like still playing <laughs> and he leans over and he says uh her dad just died <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I was dead. I like the strumming of the song is like down 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 and I was like down 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 Um Anyways uh, uh ha Happy birthday I'm gonna go <laughs> <laughs> and I just got off stage and I left. <laughs> it was the worst thing ever, dude. It was the worst thing ever. So, um, I guess that the moral of that story is know your audience.